Hey y'all, welcome back to Adventuring with Amanda. Thank you so much for being here with me and Winston. In this short video, I am showing you some new dog beds that I have for Winston in our minivan camper, as well as a really cool roller carrier that I want to share with you all. Winston is really digging his new front passenger seat bed, so we are going to talk all about it and dive right in. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and let's get started. Now, before Winston's new bed, Winston has always traveled on my passenger seat just on a blanket that was kind of folded under so I could keep the seat a little more level. There he is barking in the background. But so this is how he's traveled and he's really, really loved it. Uh, you know, he'll make his way into the back of the van when he wants to, but a majority of the time he sits in the passenger seat. So now let me talk more about his new bed. This is Winston's new bed. It is from Amazon. It is Virgin Nest is the brand. This, I believe there's only one size and so this is a small dog bed. The bottom is reversible so you can use this side in the summer. And it also has a clasp here so for safety I can put his harness on and buckle him in if I choose to do that. Um, so far he's really loving this bed so I'm excited about it but it will sit like this. I'm going to put a couple foam pieces underneath on this side to make sure it's nice and leveled up uh, like you see it is now. I love that it has pockets on the side, you know, waste bags, treats, water bottle, whatever. It has those on both sides. And this bed is completely washable, so you can take off the cover and wash it. Now, it does have two buckles as well, so this buckle will essentially go behind the headrest. And then this buckle goes around the entire seat itself so it stays nice and secure in there for your pet's safety this week well tomorrow will be winston's first time actually traveling in the bed but we tested it out he <laughs> fell asleep in it and he's loving it thus far so i hope that it works out really well for traveling and since it is a little higher up it'll help him see out the window a little bit better I found out about this brand from my friend Sarah and uh, because Bella has one, you actually probably saw it in my recent video where I showed Sarah's camper tour, but I purchased this on Amazon. I am a Prime member and I had a $5 coupon. So out the door with tax shipped to my house, it was actually only $40 and I will put a link in the description. For Winston's front seat bed, I went ahead and cut some foam pieces. I was kind of experimenting here. So now, when I put Winston's bed in there, it is level and you can't even see it. Ta-da! As most of you know, this is the bed that Winston sleeps in. It is my third row single passenger seat. So this is where he's always slept and I have leveled it with beds and pillows up until now. I had actually asked Maddie Van Halen, hey, um, since you're you know, an engineer by trade, what can I put here to level it out? And he was like, oh, all you need is wedge foam. So let me show you what I did. Ta-da, a piece of wedge foam. So here it is, this is actually wedge foam that goes into a wheelchair. I had a really hard time finding something that measured out to be, the seatbelt gets in the way sometimes, that measured out to be good for Winston's bed. And as you can see, I realized that I still needed to put this flat bed underneath it um, to help it just a little bit, but it is way more flat for him now, a much better surface. So the wedge foam will work well in there. I did a lot of research, took me a while, like I said, to find something with the proper measurements that would work for him. I believe this is 18 by 16 by four inches. Um, I did purchase on purchase it on Amazon. It was a bit pricey, especially for a piece of just wedge foam. It was, I believe, $26. This does unzip and you can throw it in the washing machine. Um, I actually looked for some foam that I could cut myself, but it was like just as expensive. So I ended up buying this and I think it'll work out just fine, especially 
putting his little like fleece blanket on top. It looks really nice and straight now and I won't constantly have to be adjusting it. And then I can put his uh, additional blankets on top for when he's snoozing. The final new bed purchase that I made for Winston is this roll up bed. The brand is Backcountry from Petco. So it's like their outdoor line, if you could guess. I found this on clearance, and what I like about it is obviously it rolls up so I can fit it almost anywhere. They did have multiple sizes, but this is the small size. So all you do is unbuckle it and unroll it, and this is the bed. So what I like about it is it is reflective for body heat um, in the summer. And then you can flip it over if you need a cooler surface. You can also put like a cooling mat or something on the top of this. The buckles are in the way, so you might need a towel or something. But this is actually great for his playpen, and I can put it on top of his outdoor bed, or I can just put it on the dirt outside, which is what I've been doing with it a lot, because it's super easy to wipe off and clean. So I love that it is compact. Like I said, I purchased it from Petco. It was $20 on clearance and I can, you know, store it in my rooftop box or really anywhere. So nice and easy, lightweight and great for any outdoor adventure. Lastly, I want to show you Winston's roller carrier. This is made by Gen 7 Pets, which is actually my favorite stroller and pet carrier brand. I have used this a lot in the past for actually airplane travel. Winston has flown on quite a few airplanes. So of course the handle goes down. There is a handle to carry it. There are also, oops, sorry, backpack straps. You can buckle it into a seat belt for safety. And then you have lots of options on the front here. So you have the front zip window, you have a bottom zip window, you have buckles right here. So if you unbuckle them and you are using it as a roller carrier, your dog will still be level in there. You also have your side storage pockets and then the side flaps, where are my zippers here? The side flaps open, hard to do with one hand here guys, sorry. <laughs> Um, all the way, which I didn't get the bottom zipper, it looks like I'm struggling with, with one hand. But anyways, they open up all the way and it also has a removable and washable pad inside, but I normally just use one of Winston's blankets. So we are headed to an event this weekend, so I will actually use this so I can put Winston in it, I can roll him around, and it actually folds nice and flat so I can store it in my rooftop box. It does not take a lot of space, so I'll be able to roll him around in there he will be nice and safe and happy and then since it doubles as a backpack or a car seat it's just really really handy to have if you have a dog a small dog a, a cat or any other animal really all right y'all i hope you enjoyed this quick informative video about winston's new beds for our minivan camper I will try to link Winston's roller carrier in the comments, but I'm not sure that it's still available because I literally bought it back in 2017. <laughs> but I will definitely link this bed and the wedge foam that I used for the back passenger seat. Thank you so much for tuning in and taking the time to watch. Be sure to like and subscribe and we will see you next time.